Hello guys and welcome to Trace Tame. Thank you guys so much for tuning in with me today. It's a pleasure to have you guys. And in today's video guys, MSNBC host Morning Joe was pulled off air because apparently they were worried that the MJ crew might say something inappropriate about the Trump assassination attempt. And I can tell you guys, he was not happy with the decision that they made to pull him off air. And his response was pretty crazy. Some things I didn't even think he would have said that he did say. Guys, check out what his response was after being pulled off air. Yesterday, uh, we were told uh, in no uncertain terms on the Sunday evening that there was gonna be one news feed across all NBC News channels yesterday. Mm -hmm. The Today Show would be Lester Holt, other, other people that well, you worked with on Sunday, and that that was gonna be one news feed across all NBC News channels, that we were going to stay as a network in breaking news mode throughout uh, all day yesterday. That did not happen. Uh, we don't know why that was ha didn't happen. Um, our team was not given a good answer as to why that didn't happen, but it didn't happen. We were also told it was going to happen throughout the day. And I, I guess after there was such a strong blowback about uh, yesterday morning, I guess they changed their plans. And so those plans changed as well. So it didn't. Um, and, uh, you know, we've talked about it uh, off the air. We'll talk about it on the air because we talk about everything on the air. Uh, we were very surprised. We were very disappointed. And if we had known that there wasn't going to be the one news feed uh, from NBC News across all NBC News channels, Willie, we obviously would have been in yesterday morning. Yeah, I was uh, here up early on Sunday morning uh, with NBC's coverage. Savannah and I uh, led the coverage on Sunday in the immediate aftermath, talking to eyewitnesses, talking to officials uh, about what happened. Obviously suited up and ready to go for yesterday morning on a, on a big morning and were uh, told that something else was going to be broadcast. So um, we are here today going through a lot, catching up mm -hmm. a little bit, but um, we want to yeah. be here for our audience and we, we know you trust us and we have ultimate respect for you guys. So. We are here today. I wish we'd been here yesterday. This, yeah, we we, we all wish we would have been here yesterday. It, it, uh, we we still are are we like to would like to figure out exactly why there wasn't that one news well, feed. So I can tell you why. It's because they did not want you to say anything inappropriate about the assassination attempt against Trump because they knew how serious it was. And I think the reason why is this show began and continues 17 years later on being the place where you can go to have the hard conversations um, in a civil way. And so it seemed like now more than ever is a day, a time that we would like to be on. And I think our viewers agree with that. So we continue. Uh, we are five minutes past the top of the hour. Well, and let me just say, <laughs> we next time we're told there's going to be a news feed replacing us, <laughs> we will be in our we'll chairs. We'll be sitting here. Yeah, <laughs> and the news feed will be us, or they can get somebody we're still else be sitting here. to host the show. <laughs> So guys, as you can see, Morning Joe said that this happens again and he don't like it, that they can literally just go find someone else. You know, that's crazy. I mean, they've been on MSNBC for a while now and like, I don't think that they would go that far as to finding someone else to replace them. I could be entirely wrong. No, listen, I could be entirely wrong. Morning Joe may just get up and say, you know what, I'm done with it. I'm done. He might just say, I'm done. I don't want to do this anymore. But I highly doubt it because as you guys know, what they have to go up against and what they have to go up against is a strong power you know you can't they can't beat them but you know what they try to do and, and we're not gonna dive all into it but guys let me know what you guys think about the video in the comment section and again guys do you think that if they did this again that morning joe would actually quit or not let me know in the comment section that'll be a wrap today's video thank you guys so much again for tuning in with me and i will see you guys on the next one take care